Hello, this video clips about what happened at the council meeting held on the 26th of September 2018. My name's Jeff Whitbread, I'm the administrator of the municipality of Roxby Downs. Following the opening statement of welcome to country and adoption of the minutes of the council meeting previously held in uh, August, there are a number of items on this agenda that I've selected a few to talk to you to about today. The first item is about the customer service policy. We've adopted a new customer service policy which basically outlines the expectations we have of our staff in dealing with customers through Roxby Water, Roxby Power and council activities, including Roxby Link. The second policy we talked through at the council meeting was an adoption of the uh, work health safety plan and the re return to work policy. This is because we've undertaken a significant review of our practices and believe this new approach is a more erudite way in which to manage our risks and return people to work after they've been injured. So the council has adopted a new policy in the re relation to that which conforms with most councils in South Australia. The next item I'd like to tell you about is the uh, road closure for the 2018 World Food and Music Festival which is to be held on the 27th of October. The road for Richardson Place on which the celebration will be held will be closed between 10am and 11pm that day between the two extremes of the street. The next item I'd like to raise is the, the fundraising platform for sporting infrastructure development. The Australian Sports Foundation have invited the Council to participate in its program whereby companies that operate within the Roxby Downs area that wish to participate in providing funding into sporting and recreation functions within the town, for example the multi-purpose pump track and skate park can do so by channelling the funds through the Sports Foundation and then they'll be eligible for a, a, a tax deduction uh, and uh, those funds will be then siphoned through the Sports Foundation to the sporting body in Roxby Downs. We think this is a good way for companies to participate, uh, particularly because many of the companies in the town do participate strongly in providing sport and recreation facilities uh, for its community. Council also adopted the report uh, for updating the uh, regional health plan for 2016-2018. Uh, the detail of that report is included in the agenda which is in, uh, on the Council's website uh, and this is a uh, statutory requirement but also indicates the state of health uh, and wellbeing in the Roxby Council area. There's another report on uh, road resurfacing for 2018 which is the adoption of the program for the uh, current financial year and an acceptance of the tender for the works. Uh, road resurfacing is to take place on the following roads, Aquila Boulevard, Melia Street, Santa Way, Taliqua Crescent, Balami Street, uh, Planningale Drive and Pagona Court. So that resurfacing will take place at a time to be advised notice on that will be to each of the residents in the street and on Facebook. Finally, uh, the Council adopted the six monthly uh, performance review for the uh, first uh, half of uh, this current calendar year and uh, that is now detailed on the Council's website. Thank you for listening and I look forward to uh, giving you an update on the October Council meeting in a month's time.